ladies and gentlemen, if I can put myself together here, that idiot, Sabu, for crying out loud, just about... Oh. Mick, before we get to this match, I want to know, are you okay? The guy ripped your glasses off, tried to rip your, your tie off, put his hands almost all over Keith Douglas here. What's going on? The guy is a complete idiot. I've never seen a guy like that. Oh, let's go to the intros. Oh. The tag team combination of the hater and the convict nails. Indian Center, teaming up with a legend, Mr. Saida. Well, what a match this is going to be, ladies and gentlemen. You have so much hardware in professional wrestling in the ring right now. The hater, the current PWA heavyweight champion. Across the ring, Charlie Norris, the former PWA champ, and Mr. Saido, the AWA, former champion of the world. I guess the convict nails might have been destined for championships in wrestling had he not gone completely berserk and gotten himself disqualified on many, many occasions. Nick, you want to talk about a crazy character here. I saw this guy pull up in back of the MTN van tonight. Gets out of, I don't even know how you describe it, some sort of Dodge van painted army oh. red. Oh, the hater, you know, he knocked the fans' popcorn out. What's the purpose in that? Anyway, there were grills over the headlights, over the windshield, over the doors. This guy is nuts. I mean, I thought he didn't want to be behind bars anymore, but oh. you wouldn't know it to see the guy's vehicle. The hater and the convict nails, ladies and gentlemen, doing battle with Thunderblood, Charlie Norris. And Mr. Saito, perhaps the most famous professional wrestler ever to come out of the nation of Japan. He has held world titles in virtually every promotion he has ever wrestled in. One of the great veterans in this sport. And in the opposite corner, we've got to talk about the hater and Nails. I mean, I am real nervous because Nails is right above us. Well, I'll tell you what, I have been taken apart once tonight already. That's enough. That's Sabu, that madman. Oh, my. And the Lightning Kid is, in fact, getting medical attention in the locker room. I'll tell you, Mick, I'm more than willing to pay my dues in this business, but I don't like the idea of getting hurt. And this guy in the, in the bright orange jumpsuit up here is oh. making me really nervous. We've got this tag team bout, ladies and gentlemen, and then the one that the entire wrestling world has been talking about. I don't know how this building is going to contain Terry Funk and Road Warrior Hawk. Oh, my gosh. I am backing up six feet when they come out. You know, you've wanted to do commentary so badly. Why don't you handle the next one? I'm out of here, pal. <laughs> <laughs> I think we'll get Tony Gear in here to do oh. it. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. That pizza guy. Yes, Tony, the pizza was free. Thunderblood Charlie Norris, ladies and gentlemen, a native of Red Lake, Minnesota. Former Rocky Mountain heavyweight champion as well as PWA heavyweight champ. His feud with the hater has been going on. It seems like eons. They just plain don't like each other. And now, Mr. Saito, look at this pump handle now. Oh, my. You oh, don't think that... No, your arm doesn't twist that way. No, no. absolutely not. Ow. That elbow right now has got to be completely out of joint. Oh, There's no. a tag in our first look at nails now. Well, this is going to be interesting. The convict, none too eager to get into the ring with Mr. Saito. Nick, if you're looking for somebody to commentate on the next match, there's a couple of fans sitting behind me that have been harassing me the whole night. I think we can get him there up them to do it. Oh, my. Oh, look at this now. Nails with that big shoulder into the midsection of Mr. Saito. Whips him across the ring. Nails is methodical in his approach. 
he is every bit as brutal as he is methodical. I can tell you that. I, I had the pleasure, well, I should say the displeasure of being in studio oh. when you interviewed this guy in Minneapolis a couple of weeks ago. My goodness. Saito takes charge. Oh, big forearm, big clothesline by Saito. Mr. Saito, ladies and gentlemen, a veteran of this sport. Oh, he dropped nails right on his head. This guy has held championships all over the world. The convict nails. Oh, look at that man's face. The Japanese press, ladies and gentlemen, in right on top of the action. Certainly some of this footage will be seen in the nation of Japan. They are shooting pictures for the Japanese magazines. Our good friend Mickey from Japan taking photographs just to our left. As Mr. Saito digs in with that nerve hold. On nails, referee Eddie Sharkey asks, asks the convict if he wants to call it a night. My God, that Lightning Kid Sabu match. This place is still buzzing. They're still cleaning up the blood from around uh, the ring here, Mick. Saito in again with that nerve hold. You know, just to see him clamp it on hurts from 15 feet away. Oh. You look at those arms and the forearms on Mr. Saito. This guy is, he is the rock of Gibraltar. And look at the face on Saito. Oh, oh the hater walked right into a boot. Big elbow. And now Saito continues the assault. Oh. Into the boot on the far side of the ring. These two certainly no strangers to each other. Oh, what a chop by Norris. My. I'll tell you, that tomahawk is becoming increasingly effective every time we see the Thunderblood. Oh, but that time, he telegraphed it. Nails quick on the assault and a, and a clothesline that dropped Charlie Norris. Took him all the way around. The National Wrestling Alliance here at the American Indian Center, ladies and gentlemen. And I don't know if it is just me, Chris. It is getting awfully warm in this building. Just the kind of uh, temperature and atmosphere that Terry Funk and Road Warrior Hawk are going to eat up. Not to mention that, but what just happened here 20, 10 oh. minutes ago, people are still buzzing around about that. Just incredible. Oh, right above our microphone, Norris drilled with the boot of nails. There's a take from the hater, nails back in. Double team action. All those big fists. He's throwing haymakers to the midsection of Thunderbolt Charlie Norris. Tosses him like a rag doll into the corner. The convict. With that ever maniacal look in his eyes, he just doesn't care about anything, Nick. Oh, that's almost 300 pounds of Charlie Norris dropped to the canvas by nails. He's so methodical, he looks at his opponents with disdain. He's, he is a, this is one angry man, I gotta tell you. And I don't like this one bit. I am getting my bicycle going here. I do not like the looks of this at all. Thankfully, they're going in the other direction. Where's Nails taking them now? He's taking them all the way, oh, oh. Into, the, into the concession area. Knocked over a garbage can with the man's head. Oh, here we go again. He's oh. got a garbage can. Oh, oh. God. Oh, jeez. Our cameras are trying to follow that action as now Nails makes his way back to the ring area. Well, now the hater's walking over. Oh, my. And now Nails is, he's not done. He came back to the ring to break up the count. And now he's going back. Oh, the hater has a big grin on his face. He's enjoying this. 
It looks like Hader. Wait a second. What is he? Oh, he's got the he's Cam got the cable. Camera cord. Ladies and gentlemen, if we lose our, our transmission here, it's because Charlie Norris is being choked with the cable. Here at ringside, I'm losing my voice for crying out loud. Oh man. Saito finally makes his way over to ringside. This man is crazy. Norris staggers to his feet. Trying to fight his way back into the ring here at the Indian Center, his home turf. Oh, oh big clubbing for him across the chest. There's a tag to the hater. Convict nails make sure Charlie Norris has no opportunity to tag. Hader is lining him up. He's sizing him up and drills him with a boot to the head. We see Eric Escala from WCCO Radio in attendance tonight. Our good friend Eric is here. Big fan of local wrestling. Is, is it just me, Mick, or is the Hader sporting a new hairdo there? Well, yeah, he's apparently spent a lot of time in the sun, Chris. So. Yeah. Well, there hasn't been too much sun around here lately, well, so I don't even want to know. Wait a second. I don't like the looks of this at all. Not at all. He's got him draped over that, over that second rope now. Saito from behind. Eddie Sharkey shakes him out. And now look at the convict nails. Oh. Seizes the opportunity to continue working on Charlie Norris. I'll tell you something, it has gone back and forth here. And Nails and Hayter are certainly holding their own at this point. Rake of the eyes. Throws him halfway across. Big, the big field throw. And now the Hayter once again takes to the man of the orange full body prison outfit. Double elbow. But well, I Mick, you know, Nails is always talking about how he was framed, how he's an innocent man, and he never did anything wrong, and he's never going to be behind bars again. Why is he still wearing the prison outfit? He's proud of it. Make oh. no mistake about it. He's, it's his badge of honor. That shows you where he's at in life. But he has a mind. I don't think this guy has a mind. He's just out to hurt people. Well, the hater from the outside of the ring making the, his own call of this ball, telling referee Eddie Sharkey that Charlie Norris is finished and that he is conceded. Sharkey's right in on top of the action. One of the great referees in this sport. Nails takes Norris back to the canvas with that reverse chin lock now. Photographer Mark Peterson from Pro Wrestling Illustrated here tonight. Major magazines in the United States and Japan covering this one. People have come from all over the world to take part in this event. <laughs> Mr. Saito has not seen a lot of action in this one. Primarily, and let's give the Devils their due, Nails and the Hater have cut off the ring. They have not allowed Charlie Norris to get over and make too many a tag. Absolutely. Norris tries to battle back. Oh, just that quickly. The momentum is stopped, and now the tag to the Hater, who drills Charlie Norris. Big chop now, Norris fighting back. Knife edge. Off the ropes now, Norris. Oh, that big size 14 right to the nose. Trying to tag Mr. Saito. As the hater makes the tag to Nails, we've got two fresh wrestlers in the ring and Saito waiting for Nails. Oh, man. Thunderous clothesline by Saito. He's got the big man reeling. Oh, big back body drop. 
Nails is in trouble right now. It's not often we have seen this big man rock to this extent. And Nails in the wrong corner as well on top of all his other woes. Here's the tag to Charlie Norris. Iris whip by Nor oh, oh, big double jump across the sternum. Nails doesn't even know where he is in the ring now. He really is. He is lost right now. He has taken a pounding, but he had enough presence of mind to rake the eyes of Charlie Norris, who waited for the hater, rolled him into the corner. And now Norris on the assault again, this time with the hater. Can Saito continue the assault? He does. Oh. Boy, you run into him, that's like running into a brick wall. This is the I've... first time I've ever had the chance to see Mr. Saito in person. Oh. And this guy... There it is, Scorpion Deathlock right here. Oh. oh, man, Nails was not about to allow that to happen. Referee Sharky telling both Norris and Hader to get out of the ring. It has all broken loose. All four wrestlers are in the ring right now. Saito is flat on his back. I'm not even sure who the legal men are right now. I don't know. I have actually lost track. I do not know. I do know that Nails and Charlie Norris have taken the battle to the ringside floor. Saito now in from behind. He's going to try to roll up the head. What's he doing? Belly to back, suplex, he dropped him right on his head. That could be it. He got him! <laughs> Mr. Saito and Thunderblood Charlie Norris victorious over the convict Nails and the hater. Let's hear from Keith Douglas. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Saito, the trip from Japan certainly was well worth it as he disposes along with Charlie Norris of the hater and nails. I believe we're going to get a word with Saito and Norris in mid-ring with Keith Douglas. Let's see if that's what's going to happen. I believe it is. Mr. Saito has opted to leave the ring area. Apparently, Charlie Norris, oh my word, and Mr. Saito have opted not to speak with Keith Douglas. What did Keith ever do? We're coming back, ladies and gentlemen, from the American Indian Center. Stay with us. We still oh, like it, Keith. Poor Keith. 